Hey guys, 460 Style here today. We're at the range. We're gonna be comparing nine millimeter, 380, and a 5.7. A lot of videos online of nine millimeter versus 5.7 by 28 and 380. So today we're, we're gonna do something just a hair different. I haven't seen a lot of videos online about this yet. Um, maybe I'm the first, I don't know. So we got a decibel meter here. It's not an expensive one. I download it on my phone. So it might not be 100% uh, accurate, but it's just the point of the difference in the sound between a nine, a 380, and a 5.7. If you guys wanna do that 5.7 to nine millimeter, nine mm debate that's been going on for many years now. So here we go. So here's the meter. And if I talk, you see how far it goes. So it is very active. So I'm gonna start with the 380 first since it's the lowest power. It's out of my baby rock. Uh, baby rock right here, I know you can't see it well because the cloudy day. Let me put my ears on and we'll try it out. I'll do my 380, I'll do my nine. It is a G2C Taurus. And I'll do the Ruger 5.7 after. I'll take two shots each. 380, here we go. All right, unchamber. 380, Taurus G2C, nine millimeter. All right, unchamber. Ruger 5.7 by 28. Oh, oh, malfunction, folks. Hold on. Hold on, folks. Malfunction, first time. I think maybe it's the ammo here. All right, let's try that again. That was one round. All right, here we go. Five, seven. All right, unchamber, unload. All right. Hope you saw the velocity, not velocity, but the, the decimal meter. Uh, I couldn't tell because I was busy shooting. Um, so uh, there it is. All right, guys. Keep it safe. Keep it real. Bring everybody to range. Watch your style. 460 style.